friends and my dear students so this is your yoga nandam biology lecture from middle academy youtube channel in this class we are going to discuss one of the biology full syllabus test paper from this paper also we are going to discuss 90 questions with detailed solutions question number 1 the portion of the embryonal axis above the level of attachment of scutellum is the portion of embryonal axis above the level of the cotyledons is the epicotyl which terminates with the plumule or stem tip the cylindrical portion below the level of the cotyledon is the hypocotyl that terminates at the lower end in the radical or root tip so the answer for this question is option b epicotyl question number 2 the fruit juices available commercially are clearer than ones which are home made which ingredient is added in commercially available fruit juices bottled juices brought from the market are more clear than home made juices as they are treated with enzyme pectinase and proteinase which dissolves the fibers present in the juice so the answer for this question is option c pectinase and protease question number 3 consider the following disorders from that how many of the above disorders are mendelian autosomal disorders the mendelian disorder is mainly determined by alteration or mutation in the single gene hemophilia sickle cell anemia cystic fibrosis thalassemia penile ketoneuria are all mendelian disorders polydactyly kleinfelder syndrome turner syndrome are examples of chromosomal disorders so from the given diseases there are five diseases are mendelian disorders so the correct option is c question number 4 the condition in which there is one to many or one to few chromosomes is called as when chromosome number in an organism increases or decreases in multiple of n then the condition is known as polyploidy but when one or more chromosome increases or decreases then the condition is known as aneuploidy for example 2n plus 1 2n minus 1 2n plus 2 2n minus 2 etc so the answer is option a aneuploidy question number 5 select the incorrect statement there are uh, four statements are given from that ecori identifies specific palindromic dna sequence g w a t t c and cuts are specific location away from center between g and a making staggered or sticky n cuts it breaks phosphodiester bonds and hydrogen bonds so the incorrect statement is option d ecori cut the dna between bases ea and t only when the sequence g w a t t c is present in the dna question number 6 if allen dna is introduced using sal1 in pbr322 then transformant will grow on sal1 restriction site is present in the tetracycline resistant gene if foreign dna is inserted in the sal1 site then the transformant will lose tetracycline resistant nature due to the insertional inactivation of the tetracycline gene with the insertion of the foreign dna the ampicillin resistant gene will be active hence the transformants will grow off ampicillin containing media so the answer for this question is option a ampicillin question number 7 a polysaccharide of cartilage is chondroitin sulfate or sulfated glycosaminoglycans it is generally called as gag and are the principal structural components of cartilages these unbranched polysaccharides are composed of alternating sugars of gl glucuronic acid and n acetyl galactosamine so answer for this question is option a chondroitin sulfate question number 8 observe the picture given below and identify the disease causing nematode that causes a great reduction in yield of tobacco plants a nematode melodin incognita infect the roots of tobacco plant and causes a great reduction in yield by causing root knot disease so the answer for this question is option c Me melodogen incognita question number 9 genetically altered bacterium used in control of environment pollution is Pseudomonas putida cleans oil spills and it is used as bio remediation for environmental pollution it has been genetically modified to increase the rate of breakdown of long chain hydrocarbons and was named as superbug so the answer is option c pseudomonas putida question number 10 what type of gamete will be formed by genotype capital r small r capital y small y a dye hybrid will form four type of gametes such as capital r capital y capital r small y small r capital y small r small y 
the number of gametes formed is determined by 2 where n number is of heterozygous gene present. So the answer is option A. Capital R, capital Y, capital R, small y, small R, capital Y, small R, small y. Question number 11. The cell A with OP10 bars and TP4 bars are connected to cells B, C and D having OP and TP4 and 4, 10 and 5 and 7 and 3 bars respectively. The flow of water will be. Deficient pressure deficit represent the absorbing capacity of the cell. It is also called as suction pressure. It is represented by DPD equal to OP minus TP. The net movement of water will be nil when DPD is zero and water moves from lower DPD to higher DPD accordingly. DPD of cell A is OP minus TP equal to 10 minus 4 equal 6. B is 4 minus 4 equal to 0. C is 10 minus 5 equal 5. D is 7 minus 3 equal 4. Hence, the water flows from B to A, C and D as B is having the lowest DPD which is 0. So the answer is option B. B to A, C and D. Question number 12. A decrease in intrapulmonary pressure to less than atmospheric pressure causes. Intrapleural pressure is the pressure of the air within the pleural cavity between the visceral and the parietal pleura. Air flows into the lungs largely due to the difference in pressure. Atmospheric pressure is greater than intra-alveolar pressure and intra-alveolar pressure is greater than intra-pleural pressure. Air flows out of the lungs during expiration based on the same principal pressure within the lungs becomes greater than atmospheric pressure. So the answer is option A. Inspiration. Question number 13. Five statements are given from that which of the following statements are true about endoplasmic reticulum. Endoplasmic reticulum is a single membrane bounded tubes which forms channels in cytoplasm. It consists of empty lumen thus it divides cytoplasm into two compartments luminal chamber inside endoplasmic reticulum and extra luminal chamber outside endoplasmic reticulum. Smooth endoplasmic reticulum carry out lipid synthesis and detoxification of toxic chemicals. So the answer is option C. All are true except third statement. Question number 14. Correct statement regarding hemoglobin. Hemoglobin is a protein found in red blood cells that is comprised of two alpha and two beta subunits that surround an iron containing heme group. Oxygen readily binds the heme group. The ability of oxygen to bind increases as more oxygen molecules are bound to heme. So the answer is option D. It binds with oxygen irreversibly. Question number 15. Match the following. During prophase, nucleolus and nuclear membrane disappears. Chromosomes occur after G2 interface. In metaphase, the chromosomes are arranged at equatorial of the cell and this phase act as the checkpoint of the mitosis. Centromere splits and chromatids are separated during anaphase and daughter chromosomes start moving towards opposite poles with chromosomal disjunction. Nuclear membrane, nucleolus and endoplasmic reticulum reappears during telophase. Thus, two nuclear formed which is followed by cytokinesis. So, the correctly matching option is option B. Question number 16. Peristaltic movement of short duration occur in. Possible peristaltic movement of short duration occurring only 3 or 4 times a day which move the contents of the large intestine from one division to the next as from the ascending to the transverse colon. So the answer is option A. Intestine. 17. Find the correct match. Leucoplasts are colorless carbohydrate which carries out a storage of food. Food can be stored in the form of carbohydrate in ameloplast, alleroplast stores proteins and alleoplast store lipids. Pyranides are special structures present in chloroplast of algae which store starch. So the correct match is option B. Alleroplast store proteins. Question number 18. Pericardium is. The pericardium is a tough double layered fibrocero sac which covers the art. The space between the two layers of the serous pericardium. The pericardial cavity is filled with serous fluid which protects the heart from any kind of external jerk or shock. So the answer is option A. Double walled membranous bag. Question number 19. Chloropyceae are grass green due to the dominant of pigment. Chloropyceae are commonly called as green algae. Their main pigment is chlorophyll A and chlorophyll B. 
and the x-ray pigments is beta carotene and xanthopyl. So the answer is option B. Chlorophyll B and A. Question number 20. Which of the following is correct regarding tricuspid valve? It prevents blood from flowing back into the right atm during contraction of the ventricle. The tricuspid valve is one of the two main valves on the right side of your heart. Normally, the tricuspid valve has three flaps. It is generally called as leaflets that open and close, allowing blood to flow from the right atm to the right ventricle in your heart and preventing blood from flowing backward. So the answer is all of these. Option D. Question number 21. Migration of dash towards the two opposite pole is the characteristic feature of the anaphase during mitosis. During anaphase of mitosis, kinetochores are pulled apart by spindle fibers. As a result, centromere splits and chromatids are separated. These chromatids are known as daughter chromosomes, which starts moving towards opposite poles. So the answer is option A, single chromatid chromosome. Question number 22. High content of Carboxyhemoglobin in blood is associated with Cigarette smoke contain a high concentration of carbon monoxide and smokers are exposed to an estimated 400 to 500 ppm CO while smoking and consequently have much higher COHP A necessary consensus given the variability level of the COHP due to the environmental CO suggests an absolute upper limit of normal COHB of 3% for non-smokers and 10% for heavy smokers. So the answer is option A. Smoking. Question number 23. Select the option with correct labeling. Artis carries blood away from the heart where it branches into even small vessels called as atioles and further branches into small capillaries where the exchange of nutrients and other waste molecules occurs. Veins carry bloods away towards the heart where it branches into even smaller vessels called as venules and further branches into a small capillaries compared to how these veins are thin walled. So the correctly matching option is option A. One is labeled as epithelial tissue, second one is smooth muscle, third connective tissue, fourth valve, fifth one is labeled that is capillaries. So the correctly matching option is A. Question number 24. The structures that remain separate with forming a layer is cells or neurons are the structural and functional units of nervous system. These cells do not form any layer and are structurally separated by getting associated with the axillary cells. So the answer for this question is option C, no cells. Question number 25. The statements are given below suits for. Insects are most successful because they show specific structural and morphological adaptations that permit them escape from the predators, natural dispersals and resisting environmental changes as they have a protective shell or exoskeleton, a small size, the ability to fly, capacity to produce a large number of offsprings quickly. So the correctly matching option is option B. Insects. The given statement shoots for insects. 26. Which, which of the following addictive habit could lead to danger of urinary bladder, throat and lungs cancer? Tar is a chemical substance made when tobacco is burned. Smoking causes cancers of lungs, esophagus, larynx, mouth, throat, kidney, bladder, liver, pancreas, stomach, cervix, colon and rectum as well as acute myeloid leukemia. So the answer for this question is option A. Tar. Question number 27. The statement is true regarding KM. Michaelis and Menton in the year of 1913 introduced a constant KM that is generally called as Michaelis constant. It is a mathematical derivative or constant which indicates the substrate concentration at which the chemical reaction catalyzed by an enzyme attains of its maximum velocity. It is generally called as Vmax. KM indicates the affinity of the enzyme for its substrate. So the answer is option D. All of these. Question number 28. An individual molecular structure within an antigen to which an individual antibody binds is as an. Antigens are the exogenous substances that is a toxin components of the pathogen or foreign particle that enters into the body and stimulates the production of antibodies. They are mainly proteins present on the surface of cells microbes such as bacteria, viruses, combining sites of antigen called as antigenic determinant or epitopes react with the corresponding antigen binding sites of the antibodies called as paratopes. 
So the answer is option B. Epitope. Question number 29. Which of the following is incorrect statement? Vascular bundles in dicostem is called as open as it consists of cambium which causes secondary growth. In dicostem, endodermis is deposited with starch sheath. Intrafascicular gambium is present inside vascular bundle between xylem and phloem. Thus, is the primary in origin. All tissues which lies outside the vascular gambium is called as bark. So, the answer is option D. All tissues lying inside vascular gambium are called as bark. That is incorrect statement. Question number 30. Bombix, Culex and Limulus belongs to. An arthropod is an invertebrate animal that has an exoskeleton, a segmented body and jointed appendages. The following families of organisms are all examples of arthropods. Insects such as ants, dragonflies and bees. Arachnids such as spiders and scorpions. Myriopods, a term which means many feet such as centipedes and millipedes. Crustaceans such as crabs, lobsters and shrimp. So the answer is option A. The largest phylum of Animalia. Question number 31. Three statements are given from that which of the above features belongs to the xylem parenchyma. Xylem parenchyma cells are living and thin walled and their cell wall are made up of cellulose. They store food material in the form of starch or fat and other substances like tannins. The radial conduction of water takes place by the ray parenchymata cells. So the answer is option D. First, second and three. All the three statements are belong to xylem parenchyma. Question number 32. Ligands are symbiotic associations of an algae and fungal component respectively. They are termed as. Ligands are symbiotic association. For example, mutually useful associations between algae and fungi. The algal component is known as pycobiont and the fungal component is known as mycobiont which is autotropic and heterotropic respectively. Algae prepare food for fungi and fungi provide shelter and absorb mineral nutrients and water for the partner. So the answer is option D. Pycobiont and mycobiont. Question number 33. Which one of the following expanded forms of the following acronyms is correct? The correct acronym is IUCN, International Union for Conservation of the Natural Resources, IPCC. C. Intergovernmental Panel on Climate Change, UNEP, United National Environmental Program, EPA, Environmental Protection Agency. So the answer for this question is option D, IUCN, International Union Conservation of Nature and Natural Resources. That is correct about the acronyms. Question number 34. Identify the structure which represent homology in the following picture. Homologous organs are those which inherit from a common ancestor representing their common origin. So the answer is option A. Axillary bud is an example for homology from the given diagrammatic representation. Question number 35. In proper hypothesis, rivets of wings are considered as. A rivet proper hypothesis, hypothesis was proposed by Stanford ecologist Paul Elrich. He considered aeroplane as an ecosystem and all rivets used to join different parts as a species. If every passenger traveling in a plane take a rivet home causing extinction of species, then it will affect functioning of flight. But removal of rivets from wings which drives the plane will affect the functioning directly. Such species which directly affect the functioning of the ecosystem are called as keystone species. So the answer for this question is option D, keystone species. Question number 36. The consequence of the industrial revolution which took place in England was The vast majority of pepper moulds had light colored wing patterns which effectively camouflaged them against the light colored trees and lichens upon which they are rested. However, due to widespread pollution during the industrial revolution in England, many of the lichens died out and the trees which pepper moulds rested on become blackened by soot, causing most of the colored moulds or typica to die off due to the predation. So the answer for this question is option D. All of the above. Number 37. Currently, more than 15,500 species worldwide are facing the threat of extinction. Out of these, what is the percentage of the threatened mammalian species? Adding to the grim scenario of the extinctions is the fact that more than 15,500 species worldwide are facing the threat of. Presently, 12% of all bird species, 23% of all mammal species. 32% of all amphibian species, 
and 31% of gymnosperm species in the world face the threat of extinction. So the answer for this question is option D, 23%. Which of the following will inactivate the process of catalysis in the catalytic converters fitted in the automobiles? Catalytic converters are fitted with metals like platinum, palladium and rhodium which converts unburned hydrocarbons into carbon dioxide and water and carbon monoxide and NO2 into CO2 and N2. Presence of lead in the petrol form a covering thus inactivates the catalyst. So the answer for this question is option B. Use of leaded petrol. Question number 39. Choose the incorrect match. It helps to regulate temperature of testes for spermatogenesis. The scrotum sac of skin that hangs from the body at the front of the pelvis. The scrotum contains the testicles. These are the two oval shaped glands responsible for the producing and storing sperms. So the answer for this question is option D. Scrotum situated inside testes. That is incorrect match. Question number 40. The all created by foam is related to. In collaboration with the Ambodit State University, the town people of Akata created an integrated wastewater treatment process within a natural ecosystem. The biologist develops a series of six interconnected marshes over 60 hectares of moss land. The mosses now constitute which is looked after by foam that is Friends of Akata Marsh. So the answer for this question is option A. Integrated wastewater treatment. Question number 41. If birth rate is equal to B, death rate is equal to D, emigration is equal to E, immigration is equal to I, then choose a correct match. Population is stable when the sum of birth rate and immigration is equal to the sum of death rate and emigration. Population is increasing when sum of birth rate and immigration is greater than the sum of death rate and emigration. Population is decreasing when the sum of birth rate and emigration is greater than death rate and immigration. So the correctly matching option is option A. Question number 42. Identify the correct statement. Testicle or testis, it is always called as pleural testis, is the male reproductive gland or gland in all animals, including humans. It is homologous to female ovary. The function of testis are to produce the both sperm and androgens, primarily testosterone. Ladic cells which secrete testosterone and other androgens lies within the interstitial space of the seminiferous tubule. So the answer for this question is option C. The interstitial space of seminiferous tubule contains Leydig cells which secrete testosterone. Question number 43. Which of the following is not a role of predation? Predation is a natural way of transferring energy across trophic level in food chain. Predators also help in the maintaining species diversity in a community by reducing the intensity of competition among prey species. It is also keeps prey population under control. So the answer is option D. It is a potent force of organic evolution that is not role of predation. Question number 44. Human semen is liquid at ejaculation but it soon coagulates and then undergoes secondary liquefaction under the influence of DAS secretion released by DAS gland. The secretory product of prostate gland which makes up part of the seminal fluid is thin and milky rich in citric acid and hydrolytic enzyme including fibrinolysine which liquefies coagulated semen after deposition in the female genital tract. So the answer for this question is option C. Fibrinolysine prostate gland. Question number 45. The rate of decomposition is controlled by. Decomposition is largely oxygen requiring process. Rate of decomposition is controlled by, by chemical composition of detritus and climatic factor. Warm humid condition promotes growth of microbes thus increases the rate of decomposition. If detritus is rich in nitrogen and water soluble substance then rate of decomposition is fast. If detritus is rich in lignin, cellulose and rate of decomposition is slow. So the answer is option C. Both A and B are controlled by decomposition process. Question number 46. ICSI stands for Intracytoplasmic Sperm Injection is the specialized form of in vitro fertilization that is used primarily for the treatment of severe cases of male factor infertility. In the ICSI process, a tiny needle called as a micropipette is used to inject a single sperm into the center of the egg. So the answer is option B, 
intracytoplasmic sperm injection is called as ICSI. Question number 47. The species that invade a bear or to start the process of succession is called as gradual predictable change in species composition of an area is called as succession. The community which starts the process of succession in bear area is called as pioneer community as the community which at the end becomes stabilized is called as climax community. So the answer is pioneer community. Which of the following artificial techniques uses to preserve sperm? In artificial insemination, a doctor inserts sperm directly into woman's cervix and uterus. The most common method is called as intrauterine insemination. This service is called as IUI when a doctor places the sperm in the uterus. The answer is option A, artificial insemination. Check the incorrect statement from the following. All animals depends on plants either directly or indirectly for their food needs. They are hence called as consumers and also heterotrophs. Animals that depends on primary consumers for food are labeled as secondary consumers. The energy trapped by the producers are passed on to the consumers or the organism dies. Death, death of the organism, the beginning of detritus food chain. So the answer for this question is option A. All animals depends on plants directly for their food needs. That is the incorrect statement. Question number 50. Which of the following is a freshwater variety of fish? Rohu and Ketla are the freshwater fishes. Their scales are bigger unlike marine fish which has small scales. They lack polyunsaturated fatty acids unlike marine fish which have them. So the answer for this question is option A. Question number 51. Select the correct match based on the type of estivation of Corolla and their examples. Aestivation is the mode of arrangement of sepals or petals in a floral bud with respect to the other members of the same world. There are four main types of aestivation, velvet, calotropis, twisted, china rose, ladyfinger, cotton, imbricate, cassia and gumar, vexillary, pea and bean. So the answer for this question is option C, imbricate, example, cassia and gulmar. Question number 52. Which of the following responses is taken up by some animals to avoid detection by predators? If a predator is efficient and over exploits its prey, then the prey might become extinct and following it, the predator will also become extinct for lack of food. This is the reason why predators in nature are prudent. Prey species have evolved various defenses to lessen the impact of predation. Some species of insects and frogs are typically colored. That is, Camouflaged to avoid being detected easily by the predators. So the answer for this question is option D. Camouflage. Question number 53. Genetic engineering has been successfully used for producing. Genetic engineering has been successfully used for producing transgenic mice. Many transgenic mice are designed to increase out understanding of how genes contribute to development of diseases. Transgenic mice are being developed for use in testing the safe vaccine before they are used in human beings. For example, transgenic mice are being used to test the safety of polio vaccine. So the answer is option A. Transgenic mice for testing safety of polio vaccine before use in humans. Question number 54. Which of the following plays an active role in Ross mechanism? The renin angiotensin aldosterone system, it is generally called as ROS, is a hormone system within the body that is essential for the regulation of blood pressure and fluid balance. The system is mainly comprised of three hormones, renin angiotensin 2 and aldosterone. Primarily, it is regulated by the rate of the renal blood flow. The juxtaglomerular cells of the kidney and adrenal gland actively takes part in the ROS mechanism. The given diagrammatic representation A represents adrenal gland, B represents renal artery, C represent renal vein, D kidney, E inferior vena cava. So the answer for this question is option D, A and D. Question number 55. Which is false for vexillary or papillonaceous estivation? In vexillary estivation, the largest posterior petal is called as standard or vexillum. Two lateral petals are called as wings and the two anterior smallest petals which are fused are known as keel petals. Vexillary estivation thus shows 1 plus 2 plus 2 arrangement of petals. So the answer for this question is option D. The largest standard and overlaps wing. 
क्वेश्चन नंबर 56 डांस ऑफ वॉल्यूम ऑफ न्यूरल न्यूरल टिश्यू इन आवर बॉडी इज कंट्रीब्यूटेड बाय न्यूरोग्लिया न्यूरल टिश्यू कंसिस्ट ऑफ टू टाइप्स ऑफ सेल्स फर्स्ट वन इज नॉन एक्साइटेटरी सेल्स दीस आर आल्सो नोन एज न्यूरोग्लियल और ग्लियल सेल्स फॉर्मिंग मोर देन हाफ ऑफ द नर्व टिश्यू दीस नॉन न्यूरल सेल्स प्रोवाइड सपोर्ट एंड न्यूट्रिशन टू न्यूरॉन्स एंड मेंटेन होमियोस्टेसिस सेकंड वन इज एक्साइटेटरी सेल्स और न्यूरॉन्स neuron is a longest cell of the human body of animal kingdom it is a structural and functional unit of nervous system so the answer is option b is option b question number from the flowering the total number of plant having epipetalous stamens when a stamen are attached to petals then it is called as epipetalous condition epipetalous stamens are present in members of solanaceae family tomato brinjal belladonna petunia tobacco chili so the answer is option b six families question number select the correct match with respect to american cockroach the zoological name is periplaneta americana abdomen in cockroach bears the following structures a anal sessi that is one pair anal sessi are jointed filamentous structures that are sensitive to sound and vibrations b anal sessi these are short thread like structures that help in copulation so the answer for this question is option d question number 59 which of the following paths have different types of roots maize is a monocot root with roots and mustard is dicot with tap root bean and mustard both are dicot with tap root wheat and jowar both are monocots with fibrous roots in grass and monstera advancia roots are present so the answer for this question is option c maize and mustard question number 60 which one of the following is correct pairing of a body part and the kind of muscle tissue that moves it smooth muscles are plain non striated involuntary or unstriped muscles due to the absence of striations these occurs in the walls of hollow internal organs in the tissues of lymph glands spleen etc in iris and ciliary body of eyes skin dermis penis and other axillary genitalia etc so the answer is option c iris involuntary smooth muscle question number 61 select the incorrect statement with respect to the prothallus of pteridophyta prothallus of pteridophyta is a multicellular free living green photosynthetic gametophyte but it lacks but and body is undifferentiated thallus which is similar to the gametophyte of bryophyta so the answer is option c it is well differentiated with vascular tissue that is the incorrect statement with respect to the prothallus of pteridophyta question number 62 how many of the given statements are incorrect there are four statements are given first one is skull it is made up of 22 bones a cranial bone that is eight bones b facial bones that is 14 bones second one is ear ossicles it includes six bones then third one is hyoid bone that is one in number fourth one vertebral column that is uh, made up of 26 bones fifth one sternum it is one bone sixth one ribs that is in 12 pairs then appendicular skeletal system comprises 126 bones first one is upper limb contains 30 bones each second one is pectoral girdle it is uh, four in number third one is upper limbs it is made up of 30 bones each and fourth one is pelvic girdle it is made up of two bones the answer for this question is option a none from the given four statements so none of the statement are incorrect question number 63 which of the following pairs of plants represent conifers conifers are gymnosperms which grow in a temperate area stem in conifers the needle like leaves reduce the surface area conifers include pinus and cedrus cygas and ginkgo are gymnosperms but not conifers eucalyptus and ulfia are angiosperms so the answer is option b pinus and cedrus question number 64 the gap between the membranes of two termed as a typical neuron consists of three major parts such as cell body dendrites axon the synaptic knob is having synaptic vesicles filled with neurotransmitters so the answer for this question is option b synaptic cleft this is a gap the membranes of two neuron is termed question number 65 the rules for 
nomenclature are given by certain organizations and are universal. Which one of the following is not a rule for naming of an organism? Biological names are written Latin only if uh, they are Latinized. The names are written in italized to indicate Latin origin. The scientific name consists of two parts. The first name is the name of genus and the second name is the name of species called as specific epithet. So the answer is option A. Biological name can be written in any language. So that is the incorrect statement. Question number 66. During complete oxidation of glucose oxidative decarboxylation occurs in during complete oxidation of glucose oxidative decarboxylation reaction occurs one in link reaction when the pyruvic acid is oxidized to acetyl CoA and the second in Krebs cycle when alpha keto glutaric acid to succinyl CoA both these reactions occur in the matrix of mitochondria so the answer is option C matrix of mitochondria question number 67 match the column A with column B is coglia it is matching with B and E that is tectorial membrane and hair cells from column A second one retina it is matching with A that contain bipolar cells then from column A third one forebrain it is matching with C and D corpus callosum and white matter so the correctly matching option is option D question number 68 which of the following statement about anaerobic resin is incorrect Yeast poison themselves to death when the concentration of alcohol reaches about 13%. Here the option D is incorrect one. If the concentration of alcohol is 7%, it becomes toxic to yeast. So that is the incorrect statement about anaerobic respiration. Question number 69. An endocrine gland which secretes melatonin is located at the pineal gland. It is left side of forebrain. The hormone which is secreted by pineal gland is melatonin. The functions of melatonin is melatonin is a very important for regulation of 24 hour that is diurnal rhythm of our body. Example, it helps in maintaining the normal rhythms of sleep, wake cycle, body temperature, etc. It also affects metabolism, pigmentation, menstrual cycle, and our immune system. So the answer is option A, dorsal side of forebrain. Question number 70. Which of the following statement is incorrect in relation to leg hemoglobin? The enzyme nitrogenase which carries out nitrogen fixation is highly sensitive to molecular oxygen and it requires anaerobic condition. To protect this enzyme, the nodule contains an oxygen scavenger called as leg hemoglobin which is synthesized by host cell and it is pinkish colored substance. So the answer is option D. It oxidizes enzyme nitrogenase. That is the incorrect statement. Question number 71. Select the incorrect match. Corticoids which regulate the balance of water and electrolytes in our body is called as mineralocorticoids. Aldosterone is the main mineralocorticoid in our body. It is formed from zona glomerulosa. Aldosterone acts mainly at the renal tubules and stimulates the reabsorption of Na plus and water and excretion of K plus and phosphate ions. Thus, aldosterone helps in the maintenance of electrolytes, body fluid volume, osmotic pressure and blood pressure. The corticoids which are involved in the carbohydrate metabolism are called glucocorticoids and they are released from zona fasciculata. In our body, cortisol is the main glucocorticoid. Glucocorticoids stimulate gluconeogenesis, lipolysis and proteolysis and inhibit cellular uptake and utilization of amino acids. Cortisol is also involved in maintaining the cardiovascular system as well as the kidney functions. Glucocorticoids particularly, cortisol produce anti-inflammatory reactions and suppresses human response. Cortisol stimulates RBC production. So the answer is option C. Glucocorticoids, zona glomerulosa. That is the incorrect match. Question number 72. Loss of water in the form of liquid droplets around a special opening of veins near the tip of grass blades is called. Effects of root pressure is also observable at night and early morning when the evaporation is low and excess water collects in the form of droplets around a special opening of veins near the tip of grass blades and leaves of the many herbaceous plants. Such water losses in its liquid phase for, uh, is known as gutation. It occurs when the rate of absorption is more and the rate of transpiration is less. So the answer is option B. Gutation. Question number 73. Read the following statements from A to E and answer the question from 
A. Thyrocalcitonin is a hypocalcemic hormone. B. Ismus in the thyroid is the thin flap connective tissue. C. The ovulation from the graphene follicle is mediated by luteinizing hormone. D. The source of follicle stimulating hormone and thyroxine stimulating hormone is the same. It is adenohypopysis. E. Hormones are non nutrient chemicals. So, from the given statements, none of the statement is uh, incorrect. Question number 74. The correct sequence of flow of electrons. The light reaction occurs in the ground of the chloroplast in which light energy causes excitation of electrons which then passes through different carriers that result in the generation of ATP. This process is known as photophosphorylation. In non-cyclic photophosphorylation, electrons excited from PS2 is passed to plastokinin via pyopitin then through cytochromes to PS1. PS1 then passes the electrons to paradoxin and then NADP is finally reduced into NADPH2. So the answer for this question is option A, PS2, plastokinin, cytochromes, PS1 and finally it reaches paradoxin. Question number 75. In photosynthesis, the light dependent reaction takes place in. The process of photosynthesis consists of two steps. Light dependent step is light reaction that occurs in the grana and the light independent step which dark reaction and occurs in the stroma of the chloroplast. In dark reaction, fixation of carbon dioxide and glucose formation mainly occurs by the Calvin cycle. So the answer is option C, stroma. Question number 76. The cut flowers and vegetables are kept fresh for long period by which of the following plant hormone? Cytokinin is a growth promoter and delays the... Cytokinin is a growth nutritional mobilization. This delay is in senescence by cytokinin is also called as Rickmond long effect. So the answer is option C, cytokinin. Question number 77. Cells of maturation phase so Cells of maturation phase attain their maximal size in terms of wall thickening and protoplasmic modification. Cells in this phase become structurally and functionally specialized. Like xylem vessels lost protoplasm, the endodermal cell wall gets deposited with suprin. So the answer is option C, both A and B. Question number 78. Which fungi are commonly used in biochemical and genetic work? Neurospora is an Ascomyces fungi commonly known as a drosophila of the plant kingdom. It is extensively used in biochemical and genetic work. Beadle and Totem proposed one gene hypothesis by working on Neurospora. Saccharomyces species. Yeast has been used extensively in genetic engineering. The Recombi vax, HB vaccine has been used by using transgenic yeast. So the answer is option B. Neurospora and Saccharomyces. Question number 79. Which group includes diatoms and golden algae? According to R.H. Vitaka's Five Kingdom classification, all unicellular eukaryotes are placed in the kingdom protist, which is divided into five classes, diatoms and golden algae are placed in chrysopies. They are microscopic and floats passively in the water currents. So the answer is option B, chrysopies. Question number 80. Viruses are considered as the living organism because it. Viruses are connecting link between living and non-living. It is living as it consists of genetic material nucleic acid and can reproduce inside living host cell to form new complete virus particle. It is non-living as it uh, due to the absence of cellular organization as it is crystalline outside a living host cell. So the answer is option A. Reproduce inside the host cell. Question number 81. Which of the following is incorrect about methanogens? Methanogens are archaebacteria which lives in the marshy area and produce methane. They cause the anaerobic breakdown of organic matter to produce methane. They are commonly present in the cuts of ruminant animals and produce a mixture of methane, carbon dioxide and hydrogen, commonly known as biogas. So the answer is option C. Methane is their uh, prepared carbon source. So that is the uh, incorrect about methanogens. Question number 82. Replication in E. coli DNA starts in the definite region known as DNA replication does not initiate randomly at any place in DNA. Replication starts at a specific region termed as the origin of replication. In eukaryotes, there is a multiple origins of replication, but in prokaryotes, there is a only a single origin of replication. So the answer is option B, origin of replication. State for the enzyme beta galactosidase, and it regulates switching on and off the operon. Hence, it is termed as. 
A lac operon, the regulator gene produces active repressor protein which binds to the operator switching it off. When bacteria and grown in the medium having lactose, it functions as an inducer and binds repressor making it inactive and switching on the system. So the answer is option A, inducer. Question number 84. The enzyme that catalyzes peptide bond formation is located in. Peptide bond formation is catalyzed by the enzyme peptidyl transferase which is a ribozyme, high molecular weight ribosomal RNA 23S in prokaryotes and 28S in eukaryotes function as the ribozyme. These ribosomal RNAs are located in a larger subunit of ribosome at P site. So the answer is option C, larger subunit of ribosomes. Question number 85. DAS is the vital link that ensures continuity of species between organism of one generation and the next. The formation of zygote is universal in all sexually reproducing organisms. A zygote is the first product of sexual reproduction which is formed by the fusion of male gamete with egg cell or female gamete. Every sexually reproducing organism including human beings begins life as a single cell the zygote. So the answer is option A. Zygote is the vital link that ensures continuity of species between organisms of one generation and the next. Question number 86. The innermost wall layer of microsporangia which provides nutrition to the developing pollen grain is Microsporangia is surrounded by four layered walls such as epidermis, endothesium, middle layer and innermost is tapetum. Tapetum provides nutrition to the developing microspore mother cells. So the answer is option D, tapetum. Question number 87. In which of the following conditions autogamy is prevented but not gatenogamy? If both male and female flowers are present on the same plant such as castor and maize, monoecious, it prevents autogamy but not gatenogamy. In several species such as papaya, male and female flowers are present on different plants. That is, each plant is either male or female. That is, dioecious. This condition prevents both autogamy and gatenogamy. So the answer is option C, monoecious condition. Question number 88. Which of the following is incorrect? Double fertilization is the characteristic sum which was discovered by Navasin in plant Lilium and fritillaria. area. Double fertilization includes syngamy and triple fusion. Pollen tube shows apical growth and chemotropic movement controlled by the filiform apparatus of Synergid. Wind pollination is quite common in grasses. In legumes, flower has vexillary estivation and shows self-pollination. So the answer is option D. Wind pollination is common in legumes. That is an incorrect statement. Question number 89. Basal part of ovule which lies opposite to micropyle is the ovule is integumented megasporangium which is protected by one or more envelope called as integuments. Integuments encircles the ovule except at micropyle. Opposite to the micropylar end is the salazar representing the basal part of the ovule. So the answer is option C. Salazar, the basal part of the ovule which lies opposite to micropyle is salazar. Question number 90. This is the last question. Identify the tissue that commonly perform the function supporting framework for epithelium. Loose connective tissue that and fibers are loosely arranged in semi-fluid brown substance. First one is areola tissue. It possesses fibroblast cells, mast cells and macrophages. It acts as supporting framework for epithelia. Second type is adipose tissue. This tissue is modified for storing fat. Excess of nutrient is converted to fat and stored in it. It is located in beneath the skin as a paniculus adiposus. So the answer is option C. Areola tissue. Thank you very much for listening our videos. Those who are watching our videos, you are requested to like, subscribe and share to your friends. All the best.